Nobody in the 135 and 140 pound division as champions opposition is ranked higher than Frank Martin. So if you're mad at Tank for fighting Frank, I need you to be irate with everybody else. God damn it! Be irate with Tio Feeble, he should piss you off. Shakur should piss you off. Uh, uh, Super Batia should piss you off. Esau Pippa Cruz opposition should piss you off, right? But y'all don't have that same energy. Because y'all, you know why? Because y'all haters. That's that's a, that's what hate is. This doesn't mean that I like Tank more than I like Esau Pippa Cruz or I like Esau more than Tio Feeble or Tio Feeble more than Devin Haiti or Devin Haiti more than Shakur. None of that. It's just being truthful and being honest. But then you know, guess what y'all guess what else y'all gonna say? Y'all gonna say, oh, rankings don't matter. Oh, rankings don't mean nothing. Shut up, bitch! From the hood to college, both worlds they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dr. PGNGM. Praise God to get money back for another YouTube video. Banger, man. Yes, sir. Yes, man. Y'all know what time it is. The doctor's in the house. Like I said, once again, y'all got to forgive me because I lost my voice from the wonderful weekend of boxing, man. We did a 12-hour stream uh, uh, watching um, what transpired between Ty uh, Tyson Fury, Alexander Usyk, all the way to uh, Emmanuel Navarrete and Denise Berichick. You know what I'm saying? We saw Usyk winning, of course, and uh, Berichick winning. But I wanted to talk about today, man. You know, it was just released, which we announced this already. You know, um, that Teofimo Lopez and Steve Claggett will be fighting, um, I believe, in June. You know, the official date has been announced. We already dropped a video a long time ago in regards to uh, uh, Teofimo Lopez fighting Steve Claggett. But, you know, you know, the thing is, it's, it's crazy to me, man. I just want to say something about this, man, you know, because it started annoying me. And this, let me be very clear before we start off. This is not. Excuse me, say what? I repeat, this is not. Come again, say what? One more time. This is not a video about bias. It's a video about truth. And if you like truth, then you will agree because there's nothing to disagree upon. But I just, you know, but let's, let's go to the, the matter at hand, man. You know, it kind of annoyed me because Teofimo Lopez is fighting Steve Claggett. Let's start with him. Let's look where he's ranked, okay? I'm not even going to say anything. Just look where he's ranked, right? Steve Claggett has seven losses. I challenge any of y'all without referencing Google, without referencing Google or Boxing Rec, to tell me anybody that he lost to. Matter of fact, tell me anybody that he won. I know some people that he lost to because I actually watch boxing. But tell me, do you know anybody that Steve Cook has lost to? So I, so, so if you don't, and if you cannot also tell me anybody he's beaten, then I need you to be mad that Teofimo Lopez is fighting Steve Cluggett. Be even madder than you are about Javante uh, Davis fighting uh, Frank Martin. You know why? Because Frank Martin is undefeated, and Frank Martin is ranked number two. <laughs> He's ranked number two. So you cannot tell me that Steve Claggett is a bigger challenge to Teofimo Lopez than Frank Martin is to, is, is to Tank Davis, right? That's number one. That's kind of loud, sorry. They're, they're, they're cutting down some trees. Remember the tornado hit, so I'm gonna go back to the, to the, to the, to the back. Um, but yeah, so, so you're trying to tell me. So, so who's, who has a better opposition, Tank or, tank or Teofimo? Who's better, Frank Martin or, or Steve Claggett? I'll wait. But wait, there's more. Okay, now let's go to the next one. You know, so we're gonna talk about all the all the all the champions uh, who have a fight at the 135 and 140 pound division. So we just talked about uh, Teofimo Lopez, right? Is he better? Is his opposition better than uh, Tank Tank against Frank? No. Okay, let's go to the next one. Um, we have uh, matter of fact, it's not that loud. I want I want to sit down for this. <laughs> I'm gonna get a little animated. I want to sit down for this. Y'all just gotta forgive the, the the noise in the background, the occasional chainsaw. So now let's go to Shakur Stevenson. You know, a lot of people are saying, "Oh, Shakur is calling out Tank. Shakur is calling out Tank." And 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 and, and, and Tank need to fight somebody. He need to fight these other people instead of fighting Frank Martin. Guess who? Guess who Shakur is fighting? He's fighting Artem Hunter Union, another fighter that's not undefeated. In fact, the same people that are discrediting Tank for fighting Frank Martin. Y'all not saying nothing about Sh Shakur Stevenson, and Shakur Stevenson is fighting somebody who, who guessed, you guessed it, he lost to Frank Martin. Boy, ain't no fucking way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. So, Artem Honey Union already lost to the person that Tank is fighting. So, how is that a bigger challenge than Frank Martin and Tank? And not to mention his ranking. He's not ranked higher than Frank Martin. He's not ranked number two. That's the, that's it right there. So let's, let's, let's move on. So we, 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 get, we got Tank. So, so was Tank uh, opposition better than uh, Shakur? Yes. Because uh, Frank Martin's better than um, Artem Honey Union. Is, 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 is Tank's opposition better than Teofimo Lopez? Yes. Because Frank Martin's better than Steve Claggett. So let's move on to... Um, Let's go. Let's go to Isak Pitbull Cruz. I like Isak Pitbull Cruz a lot, man. One of my favorite fighters to watch. He's fighting Jose Rayo Valenzuela. Let's look at the boxer rankings. Is he ranked number two? 
you guessed it, no. So, <laughs> and, we, and Jose Valenzuela, we seen him get knocked out by Edwin De Los Santos. Somebody that Shakur Stevenson beat. So, so is that better than Tank's opposition? No. So let's move on to um, who, who, who else we got. So we talked about Tio Fibo, talked about Shakur Stevenson. Uh, 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 uh. We talked about Isak Pipu Cruz, another champion. We're not going to talk about Devin Haney because you know, um, even though Devin Haney fought Ryan Garcia, if Ryan Garcia is 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 clean, then that's a great win. You know what I'm saying? We could add him to the list because Tank beat Ryan Garcia. But if Ryan Garcia is dirty, then he cheated, and I can't rock with no cheater, man. You know what I'm saying? If you, if, if if he's clean, a great, fantastic win for him and boxing. If, if, if he's dirty, then... Nigga, you's a bitch! <laughs> yeah, I can't, I can't counter. So we're going to keep Devin Haney out until the pending investigation uh, until the investigation is complete on May 22nd. Now, lastly, let's go to uh, Subaru Matias. I like Liam Paro, man. Liam Paro is, is, you know, I was very big on Liam Paro last year. I said he's going to have a breakout year this year. What he did to Montana level was great. But is he ranked higher than Frank Martin? No. So once again, you know, I I I I think Liam Barrow could have an upset against Frank Subaru Matias. I think Smart Money's on Subaru Matias. But once again, nobody in the 135 and 140 pound division as champions opposition is ranked higher than Frank Martin. So if you're mad at Tank for fighting Frank, I need you to be irate with everybody else. Oh, you mad because I'm styling on. Be irate with Tio Feeble. He should piss you off. Shakur should piss you off. Uh, uh, Subaru Matias should piss you off. Esau Pippo Cruz opposition should piss you off, right? But y'all don't have that same energy. Because y'all, you know why? Because y'all haters. That's that's a, that's what hate is. This doesn't mean that I like Tank more than I like Esau Pippo Cruz or I like Esau more than Tio Feeble or Tio Feeble more than Devin Haiti or Devin Haiti more than Shakur. None of that. It's just being truthful and being honest. But then you know, guess what y'all guess what else y'all gonna say? Y'all gonna say, oh, rankings don't matter. Oh, rankings don't mean nothing. Shut up, bitch! No, they're not just picked randomly out of a hat. Rankings mean something. You don't have to agree with all the rankings unequivocally, but rankings mean something. They do have an impact. They don't just randomly place a number beside a random boxer and say, oh, here, here it is. You know what I'm saying? So I, I need y'all to shut that mess up. So if you're going to be mad at Tank versus Frank, because I think that's a very good fight. I think it's a great fight. It's definitely better than every other champion at 135 or 140, uh, uh, better than the opposition that, that they're fighting. And that's a fact. That's a fact, ain't it? Ain't it? All right, then. If you disagree with that, then, you know, I'm gonna just need you to shut up, bitch. Oh my God. Oh my God. Yeah, but yeah, <laughs> that's it. That's it for Dr. PGA GM. You know what I'm saying? Dr. Boxer Talk is out, man. I appreciate y'all. Remember, with God, we can do anything. Without God, we're nothing. Doctor's out. Peace. Catch y'all on the flip side. From the hood to college, both worlds they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets.